Hello everybody, good morning. In Bible times, if you wanted to walk from Jerusalem to Galilee, you had to go through Samaria, which was a land in which the Sumerians obviously lived. Now, there was great conflict between the Sumerians and the Jews. So rather than go through Samaria, people would go a long route around and then get to Galilee. It would be a bit like me wanting to go to Horston and going up the valley and via Caledon and coming down via Bot River and eventually past Fisherhaven to Horston. Now that sounds crazy. Uh, why don't you just go straight to Horston? Well, they didn't do that in those days. But on one occasion, Jesus decided to cut right through Samaria. And it's wonderful because he knew, I think, that he had an appointment, he was going to meet somebody who needed his counsel and ministry. So Jesus is thirsty, and he comes to the well of Jacob, and uh, he's on his own, and a woman comes up. She is there, it's around about 12 noon, to get water. And Jesus asks her, could I have something to drink? She's taken aback, and she says, why do you, a Jew, ask of me, a Samaritan woman, for something to drink. And then Jesus says this, if you knew the gift of God and who it is that is asking you, you would, he would give you water. If you keep coming back to this place, you will keep on being thirsty. But if you drink of the water that I will give you, it will become to you like a well, a gushing well of water springing up to everlasting life. Well, you can understand, the, the woman is taken aback. What is this living water that Jesus is speaking about? Well, the living water is the Holy Spirit. What a lovely picture that is. Not dry, stagnant, polluted water. No, we see lots of those that kind of water in little pools, perhaps in the street, water that has lain there for a while. It's, it really is, as we say, yucky water. Jesus is talking about living water, and he can give us this living water, and it is for us like a well of living water gushing up to everlasting life. And this little wonder, the woman said, please, sir, give me that water. Now, I want you to hold that picture. You know, we have wonderful rivers in spate at the moment. Uh, they've been dry during the, the summer months. Suddenly, after the rains of last week, that water is rushing. That water is cleansing the the, the banks, it is renewing everything where there were little corners of pollution. It's all gone because the mighty refreshing water has cleansed it all. The living water of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let your living water flow over my soul, says the song. Let your Holy Spirit come and take control. Make that your prayer today. God be with you.